Good morning, Huskies. Today, I have some fun stories to tell you, and I also have some games that I want to play together. I'm going to need your help to tell me. I'm going to need your help so that I can tell the stories today. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to play a game of hide and seek. And but we're not going to be hiding. We're going to play with our toys, and our toys are going to be hiding, and we're going to be seeking. So it's going to be a special game of hide and seek, and you can play with me. So if you want to play with me, when I say go, you can pause the video, go get some really small toys, like Legos or something else that's really small, and then a cup. You, you need at least four Legos. When I say go, you can pause the video, go get the cup and toys, and come back and play the video. Go. Okay, Huskies, I'm assuming you're all back with your toys. So I'm going to be playing with my magnets. You can be playing with anything else that is small enough to fit in a cup. And so then, I have my cup. And how many magnets do I have, Huskies? First, I want to count how many magnets I have. Let's count. One, two, three, four. How many magnets do I have? Four. Good job. Show me four with your fingers. So they are going to hide in my cup. They're going to all go into their hiding spot, and we're going to start seeking. So I'm going to, let's close our eyes, and we're going to count to ten, and give them time to hide. Everybody put your toys in your cup, cover your eyes, and let's count to ten so that our toys can hide. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, let's go looking for our toys. Huskies, I found one toy. Can you all find one of your toys? And I'm gonna put my toy here. So Huskies, I had four toys. And I have, I found one, and he's gonna go in the found pile. How many toys do you think are left in the not found pile, in the cup that's not found? Show me with your fingers how many toys you think are left in the cup. Let's find out. One, two, three. Huskies, I had three magnets left in my cup because I had four and I found one. And when you take away one, you're left with three. Okay, so this guy, he won. So he gets to go into the into, into the found pile. So I have three more magnets that are still gonna hide this next round. So we're gonna put them in the cup. One, two, three. How many do I have in the cup? Three, good. So we're gonna give them time to hide. Let's cover our eyes and count to 10. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ready or not, let's look for some. Let's look for our toys. Huskies, I want you to find one toy and put it into a found pile. So I had three toys and I found one toy. How many toys do you think I have left in my cup? Let's find out. One. Two. Huskies, I had two toys left in my cup. Because I had three all together, I, found, I took away one, and I had two left. So we're going to put this one in the found pile. We're going to do one last game. So how many toys are going to go hide in the cup? One, two. Two of my magnets are hiding in the cup. You can put two of your magnets in your cup to hide. And now we're going to close our eyes and let our magnets, give our magnets time to hide. Count to ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Time's up. Let's look and find one toy. I found one toy. So Huskies, I had two toys. I found one. How many do you think are left in my cup? Show me with your fingers how many you think are left. 
Let's find out. Huskies, I have one magnet left in my cup. Because if I started with two, and I found one, then I have one left. So Huskies, that's the end of our hide and seek game. You can put your Legos and your cup to the side. For our next thing, I want to tell you some stories about things that I, uh, about a party, a birthday party that I went to, and then a walk around the pond that I went on the other day. So you can help me write those stories. If you want to help me write the stories, you can go get a piece of paper and a crayon or a pencil. If you want to get a piece of paper and a crayon, when I say go, you can pause the video, go get the stuff, and then come back and play the video. Go. Okay, Huskies, I'm assuming you have your piece of paper and your crayon. First, I want to tell you about a birthday party I was at. Now, my favorite thing about birthday parties is the balloons. So I love when there's a lot of balloons, and I saw this really fun birthday party with five balloons. So on your piece of paper, I want you to help me draw five balloons. And we're going to do a circle and a squiggly line. So help me draw and count them. One, two, three, four, five. Huskies, how many balloons do I have? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five. How many? You're right, five. Can you write the number five under the balloons? So Huskies, the next thing that happened is we were playing with the balloons, but I accidentally popped them. And sometimes balloons can be easy to pop. And that's okay. But it was really fun while we were playing with them, but I had two balloons pop. So I'm going to draw an X over each balloon that I popped. I want you to do that with me. Help me count as I draw my X's. One, two. Huskies, how many balloons did I pop? I popped two balloons. So I had five and I took away two. That's called subtracting. Now I want to figure out how many balloons do I have left? Can you help me count how many balloons I have left? Let's count. One, two, three. How many? You're right, Huskies. I had three balloons left. So when I had five and I took away three, nope, I'm going to say that again. When I had five and I took away two, I had three left. Okay, Huskies. I'm getting erased, but if you want to help me tell my next story, you can flip your page over to the other side. So the other day, I was taking a walk around a pond. Can you help me draw a pond? For the pond, I'm going to draw a big blue circle, and I'm going to draw some waves because the, pond, the water was moving. So this is my pond. And on the sidewalk, there was a sidewalk right next to the pond, so I'm going to draw a sidewalk. Can everybody draw their sidewalk? And on the sidewalk, I saw five leaves. How many leaves did I see? Five. Can you draw, write the number five under the pond? And I'm going to draw five leaves on the sidewalk, so my leaf going to look like that. And I'm going to color in some green. Can you help me draw five? This is one, two, three, four, five. So once you have your five leaves and your pond, I'm going to tell you what happened. It got really windy. The wind started blowing around and some of the leaves started to be blown from the sidewalk into the pond. So first, I saw one leaf be blown into the pond. Let's draw an X over that, over that leaf. I started with five leaves, and we lost one. So Huskies, how many leaves were still left on the sidewalk? 
Help me count. One, two, three, four. How many leaves did I have left? You're right, Huskies. I had four leaves left. Four leaves. So I'm, now I had four leaves. But then the wind picked up again and went, woo, woo, and there was lots more wind. And then we lost another leaf. So I'm going to draw an X through that leaf. Can you draw an X through your other leaf? Hmm. So now I started with five leaves. Remember I started with five leaves? But how many leaves have blown into the water now? Let's count. Let's count how many X's I see. One, two. How many leaves went into the water? You're right, Huskies. Two leaves. So I started with five, and now I've lost two. How many leaves do I have left? Let's count. One, two, three. How many? You're right. Three. Because if I start with five and I lose two, I'm left with three. Huskies. Then the wind picked up another time. And it went woo, woo, woo. And another leaf went into the water. Let's draw an X over the next leaf. Now another leaf was lost to the water. So Huskies, if you remember, I started with five leaves. How many, how many leaves have gone into the water now? Let's count the X's. One, two, three. How many? You're right, Huskies. Three leaves have gone into the water. So how many leaves do I still have left on the sidewalk with me? Let's count. One, two. How many? You're right, Huskies. Two. Can you show me two with your fingers? Good. So if I have five and I lose three, I have two left. Then, oh my gosh, you're not going to believe it. It kept happening. It got windy again. And this was the windiest thing. And it went woo, woo, woo. And I lost another leaf. Another leaf went in to the pond. So Huskies, if you remember, we started with five leaves. How many leaves did we start with? Five. You're right. How many leaves have gone into the water now? Let's count. One, two, three, four. How many? You're right, Huskies. Four. Can you show me four with your fingers? Four. And how many leaves are left on the sidewalk? How many? You're right, Huskies. One leaf. I'm going to draw one because when we have five and we lose four, we're left with one to go. And I didn't want to leave, lose that leaf too, so I put that leaf in my pocket. And that is the end of my story. Okay, Huskies, thank you for helping me tell my stories. Now I want to show you what to do for your seesaw assignment. So I'm going to erase my board. You don't have to do anything. Put your crayons down if you have them. Put your pencils down if you have them. And now you just have to watch me as I show you what I do. So when you go on to Seesaw, you're going to see different pictures. And the pictures are actually about something that happened to Husky last week. So this is going to be a homework assignment about Husky. So Husky was really hungry. And he was walking down the street. And he saw some flowers, and he ate the flowers. And then he saw some food, and he ate the food. And then he saw some bees, and he ate the bees. And so he was really hungry, and he did lots of eating. And we're going to do some subtracting to see how much is left. Now I'm going to draw the number of flowers that Husky saw. When you go on a seesaw, you're going to see different pictures of all the things that Husky saw. Let's count how many flowers he saw. One, two, 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Huskies, how many flowers did Huskies see? You're right, he saw eight flowers. So under each picture, you're gonna see two numbers. You're gonna see a red number, and the red number is gonna be how many Huskies saw. So he saw eight flowers. And then you're gonna see a green number. And the green number is how many Husky ate. So how many flowers did Husky eat on his walk? You're right, he ate two flowers. So you're going to take the green marker and you're going to draw an X over the number of flowers that he ate. So I'm going to count one, two. I just drew an X over each flower that he ate. And then you're going to click the brown marker and you're going to write how many flowers are left because there were eight and then he ate two, and we're going to see how many are left. So let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six. How many flowers are left after he ate? You're right. There are still six flowers. And you're going to do that for the, for the other food that he ate. You're going to do that for each problem. And after you finish the problem, you're going to click the green check mark to turn it in. Have a great day, Huskies.